guys welcome back this is a Publix haul um, I ordered Publix through Instacart today and uh, it was really fast I don't know who my shopper was actually I do know uh, I think his name was Chris but anyway he was super fast at picking all this stuff out and he did a really good job so he must know that store by heart but anyway um, I decided to do Publix because Harris Teeter's app has been acting funny and yeah, I didn't want to mess with it anymore. So anyway, I ordered a bunch of stuff. We're going to go ahead and get started. I got some organic bananas here. Uh, we just needed some bananas. We're completely out. I found this red kale on their app and it sounded really good. This is organic. Um, it's really dark purple and green. It just looks great. <laughs> um, and then some Caesar salad. My husband loves Caesar salad. He eats a salad like, I don't know, three days a week. Um... So we're always buying those. I got a hot dog lunchable back here for Jackson. And then, of course, these mandarin oranges. He loves these things. He eats these like crazy. And they're so easy for him to peel. Um, and then I got some Honeycrisp apples. These are organic. This one's got a bit of a bruise on it. It's not looking the best. But that's okay. I'm going to cut these up and make applesauce out of them anyway. So, um, yeah. And then I got some snow peas um, for stir fry one night. And then some sugar snap peas for Jackson. He loves to munch on um, sugar snap peas. So I'm actually trying to grow some snap peas. Oh, and I got some garlic back here as well. Um, this was actually cheaper than buying just a regular head of garlic. So this little two pack um, was almost a dollar cheaper. It was very strange. Um, but anyway, I got two avocados here just to make a small batch of guacamole. I've got some cilantro already in the refrigerator, so I've got that. Um, some more of the Nisoya Thai basil vegetable dumplings. We really, really enjoy these. Um, so I'm probably going to make this with um, these snow peas right here. Maybe some rice or something one night. Um, yeah, quick and easy dinner. And then I found this Amy's Organic Moroccan uh, Vegetable Tagine. It just sounded really good. I've never seen this one before. Um, so I wanted to try it out. Um, and then this tofu scramble, uh, I ordered this at one point, um, and remembered that I really, really liked it, um, but never ordered it again. So I saw it and was like, yeah. And then of course the sweet earth cauliflower mac. I love this one. Super quick and easy. So these are like my work lunches for the week. And then two days I'll probably do peanut butter and jelly or something. Um, and then some silk vanilla almond milk yogurt. You guys know this is my favorite one that I can find at my stores. Um, and yeah, they usually, I usually get the four packs, but they didn't have those. So I just ordered six of the single ones. And then some yogurt strawberry back here for Jackson. Um, he likes his yogurt too. And then Publix didn't have Bobo's, you guys, or at least not the Bobo um, tarts. So I saw these Nature's Path ones, and I love the brand Nature's Path, so I figured we'd try these for Jackson and see if he likes them. Um, but he picked out the grainy apple pie ones. And then I got some regular um, brown sugar cinnamon Pop-Tarts back here, um, kind of as treats. He doesn't really get these that often, um, but I like to have them on hand as like a little treat for him um, for doing good in school and stuff like that. So, And then some ketchup. We just needed some more ketchup. Uh, in the house, my husband likes the Heinz brand. And then, um, I don't typically, I hate mayonnaise, you guys. I've never eaten mayonnaise since I was like four, you know, unless it's really mixed in with something. Um, but vegan mayonnaise and spreads and stuff like that actually don't bother me as much as regular mayonnaise does. So I don't know why, but I needed some mayonnaise for a recipe. So I got that. I needed some Old Bay. You guys don't laugh at my spice cabinet. It's so disorganized in here um but i had this big thing in here i've had it for a little while but it's almost empty you guys so i use old bay to season all kinds of stuff corn roasted vegetables you name it i put old bay on it um so i needed some more i'm actually from maryland so you know we need to have our old bay <laughs> anyway um and then i got some tamari here i was actually looking for um coconut aminos but the one that they had was really expensive. So I just went ahead and got some tamari because I figured, well, this is, it's gluten-free and it's, you know, better than soy sauce, I guess. I don't, I don't really know. Another Lunchable for Jackson. I got some fully cooked bacon for him. And then I picked up the Beyond Sausages. Again, I got the hot Italian ones. It was seven sixty. what does that say? Seven sixty four. Um... So these usually I can make like one 
two meals out of this or sometimes depending on what I'm making I can actually get three or four meals out of uh, a pack of these so you know it stretches um, and then I needed some more powdered sugar Jackson really likes powdered sugar on his French toast in the morning so I got that and then I got some apple cinnamon oatmeal for him I've been trying to get him to eat like old-fashioned oats but we're not quite there yet um, so he really likes this instant oatmeal, you know, and so I got that for him. And then some Cheerios, of course, uh, for Jackson. I got the Orville Redenbacher's Movie Theater Butter Popcorn again, and then some Canada Dry, kind of on a ginger ale kick. And then, okay, so Chobani Oat, the extra creamy one, is our favorite here. But I saw they had the nut milk, and I've seen a lot of people talking about this one, and they were the same price. So, typically I buy two of the Chobani. So, I was like, well, I'm just going to go ahead and buy one of each. We're going to try out the nut milk and see if we like it. If not, we'll probably just stick with the Chobani oat milk. Um, we may just stick with it anyway. I got some hazelnut creamer for my husband, and then some lightly salted potato chips for him, and then I got some barbecue barbecue potato chips for myself um I love barbecue chips and then I got some of the extra crispy uh french fries for Jackson and then some golden tater tots for my husband I actually like the french fries better uh than the tater tots but my husband likes tater tots so anyway guys that is everything that we got from Publix for the week um probably this is gonna last us longer than a week um most of it will anyway but yeah that's it um I do have a Misfits Market uh, haul that I'm going to edit after this one and post that as well. So you might see it before this, you might see it after this. But anyway, guys, that's everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Stay tuned for more and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.